The ODM Reloaded team was in Kajiado County for a homecoming party of the recently nominated East African Legislative Assembly member Judy Pareno, who was nominated by ODM party. It is here that members of the Orange Party launched a scathing attack at the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission for what they termed as an unprofessional way of handling the tendering process for acquiring the biometric voter registration kits. We are warning IEBC. Listen to me, Isaac Hassan and Oswago. Listen to me very keenly. Kenya went to war because another team like you interfered with the integrity of the popular will of the people of Kenya in 2007. If you dare, if you dare, dare again, attempt to play around with this electoral process again, Kenyans will not permit it. I'm challenging the chairman and the CEO, Oswago, Wambie wa Kenya, the truth about the tender which is going on. If they are not ready, Wambie wa Kenya, they are not ready to conduct free and fair elections. IEBC had awarded the tender to an Indian company 4G but later disbanded the tendering committee and appointed a new one that settled for Symphony Africa, a Kenyan company, to be in charge of the supply of the 3.9 billion shilling equipments for voter registration. ODM doubts that the award of the tender was above board. Biometric tendering. Na kupatia company ambayo inajulikana viongozi ama wale ambao wanaongoza hiyo kampuni ni watu ambao iko na question mark we want to tell electoral commission we are watching this company called symphony africa is reputed to be backed by some very shadowy figures wheel dealers some mysterious activists from all over the place people that are known not to have the best interests of kenya at heart ODM says for IEBC to avoid losing the trust of Kenyans, just like what happened to Kivuitu-led ECK, they should do everything in the open and refuse to be compromised by politicians. Aaron Ochen, KTN Live at One.